Welcome to Bespoke Blog. This blog is about nanorobotics, a futuristic medical treatment. Robotics is an interdisciplinary field that integrates computer science and engineering. It involves design, construction, operation, and use of robots. The goal of robotics is to design machines that can help and assist humans. Robotics integrates fields of mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, information engineering, mechatronics, electronics, bioengineering, computer engineering, control engineering, software engineering, among others. Nanorobotics is an emerging technology field creating machines or robots, whose components are at or near the scale of a nanometer, Nanorobotics refers to the nanotechnology engineering discipline of designing and building nanorobots, with devices ranging in size from 0.1 to 10 micrometers and constructed of nanoscale or molecular components. This technology aims to work at the molecular level, atom by atom, to create large structures with the fundamentally new molecular organization. The idea of modern nanotechnology has resulted in the creation of smarter and superior nanotechnology products, which has left its imprint on many engineering and basic science fields. It is a multidisciplinary arena that necessitates specialized level input, from a variety of scientific and technological disciplines, including physics, chemistry, genetics, medicine, medicinal sciences, engineering, biotechnology, and other biomedical sciences. Adriano Cavalcanti, is the medical nanorobotics inventor for the practical hardware architecture of nanorobots, which was integrated as a model based on nanobioelectronics, for the application in brain aneurysm, cancer, diabetes, cardiology, and environmental monitoring. Nanorobots of different shapes and sizes are now capable of delivering medicine, to specific organs in the human body through veins. For instance, nanorobots can be programmed to transport molecular payloads and cause on-site tumor blood supply blockages, which can lead to tissue death and shrink the tumor. Nanorobots are made by using several components such as sensors, actuators, control, power, communication, and by interfacing special cross scales between organic and inorganic systems. Medical nanorobots are nano devices used for the purpose of maintaining and protecting the human body against pathogens. They can be used very effectively for drug delivery. Normally, drugs work through the entire body before they reach the disease-affected area. Using nanotechnology, the drug can be targeted to a precise location which would make the drug much more effective and reduce the chances of possible side effects. Nowadays, nanorobots play a crucial role in the field of treatment of cancer, cerebral aneurysm, removal of kidney stones, elimination of defected parts in the DNA structure, heart attack, and anemia. It has a bright future as an ultra-fine drug delivery device. There are many productive discussion being carried out, about the potential use and past-present research scenario of nanorobotics and various new approaches. Characteristics of nanorobots 1. Nanorobots must be between 0.5 and 3 microns in scale, with 1 to 100 nanometers parts. 2. The passive, diamond exterior can protect it from being targeted by the immune system. 3. It can communicate with the doctor by decoding messages to acoustic signals, with carrier wave frequencies ranging from 1 to 100 MHz. Benefits of nanorobotics, extremely portable and lightweight, abundant resources available for production, rapid eradication of disease, they self-clone themselves to replace worn-out units, cost-effective, speed up medical treatment, painless treatment, easily disposable, they remain operational for years, decades or centuries. It is possible that the most critical potential role for nanobots will be to perform difficult repairs, that currently require significant surgery, such as removing plaque from blood vessel walls or renewing calcified heart valves. The body has amazing healing mechanisms, but for causes that are still unexplained, those behaviors proved to be unlikely. Thank you for your time. 
Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Do leave your thoughts in the comments section below. Please reach us at contact at thebespokediaries.com or you can visit our website www.thebespokediaries.com.